stay right here We should lay right here Cause everything is okay right here Hey guys, so before I get started with this haul, I want to say thank you for 100,000 subscribers, you guys, like, you guys have no idea how much you mean to me, and I got super excited, I was getting off of work when somebody tweeted me, and they were like commenting all over my Instagram, like, congrats on 100k, and I was like, <laughs> thank you guys so much, so right now what I'm gonna be doing is showing you guys everything that I got from Generation Beauty, because if you were like a beauty creator or something, you got like a swag bag, like if you got like general admission to it, then you still got stuff, but a lot of stuff came in a swag bag, so I thought I'd show you guys everything that came in here. So. This is the bag that has everything in it. Yeah, it's pretty cool. But then there's also this other makeup bag that is also full of makeup. So what I'm gonna do is just go through everything individually. I'm not gonna like open every product and be like, oh, and this is what the detail looks like, this looks like this, cause that's gonna take too much time and ain't nobody got time for that. So the first thing is this makeup bag. It had a lip gloss in it and it also had a like phone charger, like a portable phone battery pack and I don't know where it went because the zipper's open and there's nothing in here so I don't know what happened. Maybe it fell in the hotel. I don't know. Next I got this stuff from Dermalogica and it came with okay it came with this baggie a littler one and then inside it has this and it was the Dermalogica clear breakout clearing all over toner so I've already used this and what I did was I sprayed this on my face because it is a mist and I put this on my face um, after I washed it last night, so yesterday was the first time I used it. And at first I thought because it's a toner that you'd have to use like a little pad and like kind of like go over your face with it, but it's not. And then there's one more thing in here, and it is the Dermalogica Clear Oil Clearing Matte Moisturizer. So that's what I got from Dermalogica. From It Cosmetics, they gave a makeup baggie, and the first thing is the the year. Bye Bye Under Eye Full Coverage Waterproof Concealer, a Vitality Lip Flush, which was just a chapstick, which I've been using and I really like it, Bye Bye Pores, which is a micro powder to make your skin look flawless, and I used it the other day and I really liked how it looked, their Brow Power, which is a brow pencil, I haven't tried this yet, um, I don't know why this is in here, but it's the Bare Minerals Well Rested Face and Eye Brightener. This was in the other bag, so I don't know why that's there. And something else is in here that doesn't belong here. The LA Girl Pro Prep. This is the It Cosmetics Hello Lashes, and this mascara is supposed to make your lashes grow too. And then this is the Your Skin But Better CC Cream. It's full coverage cream, it says. And it is in the color medium, so they got the color right, and I'm so happy. And then this is an LA Girl Pro Setting HD High Definition Setting Spray. And then of course there was a, a little note in here from them. And then it came with another makeup bag. So I like that, I got all these extra makeup bags. I'm um, just gonna start pulling stuff out. So this is the Chlorin Dry Shampoo with Oat Milk. I've already used it and you guys, it works. Like it is some strong stuff like, and it smells really good. There are these Proactive Makeup Cleansing Wipes. I've only used one of them so far. And they're very, very like moisture, or not moisture, that makes no sense. They're very moist, so it will get all your makeup off because there's a lot of like product on those. This is the Advanced Dark Spot Correcting Serum, I haven't tried it yet. This is the Saint Tropez, 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 I don't know how to pronounce it, Self Tan Express. And if you leave it on for one hour, you get a light tan. This one says for two hours, you get a medium tan, three hours for a dark tan. So. Yeah, might try that, we'll see. Um, also, this was an IT Cosmetics brush that was supposed to be in the baggie, but I've been using it, so yeah. And then an LA Girl Pro Powder, so I'll have all these setting powders. Now these, you guys, oh my gosh. I don't know where the other one is, it's somewhere in here. But you guys, you have no idea, like these are the bomb.com. So which one is open? I've been using one of them, I don't know. I don't know which one it was, but these are BB cushions, and you guys, like, oh my goodness, let me just open one so you can see really quick what it is. So basically, it is a BB cream, but in cushion form, so it comes with, like, these little pad thingies, and I'm not going to open it, because this one's new still, but there's, like, a little cushion in there filled with BB cream, and you push on it, and then you go like that all over your face, and it has great coverage. That's what I'm wearing today, and that's what I've been wearing for the past few days, and I love it. Like, I'm not going back to foundation. I absolutely love this. And I first discovered BB cushions 
through this YouTube channel called Insight TV and it's like stuff from like Korea and China and Japan and stuff like that. So um, I discovered it through there because I guess they use it a lot over there. Like they're big on BB cream versus like actual foundation and that was something they kept promoting on there. So I discovered it on there. I got a full proactive kit but I will never use this because proactive, once you stop using it, it actually attacks your skin somehow. I have heard this from so many people and so many people on YouTube have said don't use proactive unless you think you're going to use it for the rest of your life because once you use it, yes you will have beautiful skin but after you stop purchasing it, your skin goes to shit. So I'm not going to use it. I also got some Lush products and I've also been using one of these and it's been working really really well with my skin. So the one I've been using is the Angels on Bare Skin and it's just a face and body cleanser and I've really been liking it. It smells like lavender which is my favorite scent for some sort of like you know essential oil. And then this is Life's a Beach Body Scrub and they said that they haven't released this yet so we got to try it first or something which I thought was pretty cool but I'm yet to have tried it. There is a Bare Republic Natural Mineral Sunscreen for your face. I've already tried this. I tried it right before I went to the beach. And you guys, this is so greasy and so oily. So I don't really like this because, like, I don't know. Maybe I didn't get a good one. Or maybe that's just how it is because it made my face really, really greasy. This is the Proactive Redness Relief Serum. I might try this because it doesn't have any, like, what's it called? Acne medication in it. It's just to make your face like not as red so I might use it like around my nose or something it's like a mask I got this Sephora Lotus mask haven't tried it then I got all these nail polishes for the summer and these are the China Glaze Neon nail polishes so I got all of these so yeah I could definitely use these on my toes I really like cobalt blue so it's probably gonna end up on me and then this is the cord to the little charger thing that I got from Sephora this is a dry fast top coat a microdermabrasion scrub from Derma, and then this was from um, Be a Bombshell Cosmetics, which I have a few things from. So what? Oh, here is the Sephora stuff. It's just a glitter eyeshadow and a pink lip gloss. So from Be a Bombshell, it is their Tango lipstick, um, their Fetch, <laughs> Fetch, <laughs> blush, and let me show you what it looks like. It's just a really pretty coral color. I really, really like that. I have a few things from them and I like their stuff. Um, this is just a like coral colored lip gloss and some eyeshadows which I don't really like because it's like bright blue and like green, like, like leaf green and they're not really that cute so probably not going to use those. Um, there is, oh, I guess this goes with like the company that made like the BB cream and stuff and they have a lot of skincare products. Huh. Oh, exclusively at Target now. Great, now I'm gonna go and get myself from Target because I thought I was gonna have to order it or something. And this baggie is from NYX, so they gave us quite a few things and it's all wrapped up, so. The first thing in here is their gel pencil liner, which I have heard a lot of good things about and it also has a sharpener on the inside. So I'm really excited to use that. And this is another one, but this one's in the color brown, so the other one's in black. I got this um, color correcting concealer, so I can use like this one for like redness, this one for like any dark spots, you know. You know how all that stuff goes. And then I could even use these to like contour if I ever decide to contour one of these days. Um, an eyeshadow, a blue eyeshadow. Get all of that out. Um, this is a matte liquid liner. It looks like it's been opened, so I'm kind of mad about that, unless maybe my mom opened all this stuff. Um, the high voltage lipstick, which is in a nude color, which is my fave. And then I got one of their butter glosses in red. I got a, another lipstick in red. Ooh! And then I got one in purple, which is gonna be very handy. I'm gonna probably put this on today, actually. And then a pink one. And then a brownish um, taupey brown metallic what's it called eyeshadow almost an eyeliner now let's go through all of this you guys like when i got this i was like hey i got a makeup pouch but then i opened it y'all this is all like <laughs> i already oops 
I already put my, like, this is the BB cushion I was using today, but everything else in here, you guys, like, okay, let's just go through all of this one by one. Like, you guys are going to be so excited with me. Okay, so this is the Buxom Lip Gloss, which I have on right now. There is a little um, Smashbox primer. There is a Bare Minerals Lash Domination. A Smashbox Pure Angle Pure Pigment Gel Liner. I've already used the black one, which is somewhere in here. This is the Bare Minerals Marvelous Moxie Lip Gloss. I haven't tried this yet, but my mom has a few of them, I believe. This is the Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Blush in Fearless. And I was so excited for this because I've never used their blush before and it's just like so pretty. This is a Chilla Cappuccino Highlighter, which I've never heard of a cappuccino colored um, highlighter, but definitely going to try it out. The Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara and if you watch my channel and if you've watched it for a while you know this is my favorite mascara and it's almost $30 and I refuse to pay for it so now I'm like <sighs> free. This is the um, Tristec, Tristique and this is a color and contour cheek. I don't know how this would be for contouring because it is not really a contour color it's more of a just a bleak, a bleak, bleh, a blush color but I think the packaging is absolutely adorable. This is a City Color um, highlighter and bronzer. I'm probably going to use like this part for like bronzing and then that for like my highlighting and stuff. This is a Bare Minerals blush, or not blush, eyeshadow palette, my bad. And this is what it looks like if you're curious if I can open it. This is what it looks like, some pretty natural colors. So that's going to come in handy because these are some pretty common colors that you will find on my eyes. I got some Ardell lashes. It comes with a little Ardell glue. There is a crown. I think this is crown brushes. So I got this one. Um, this one I used so it's out of its packaging. But it is the Tarte Lights Camera Lashes 4-in-1 Mascara. This is a lipstick by Galani Cosmetics. And it's just a black lipstick, which is awesome because you guys know I love the color of black. I already have a black lipstick from uh, Makeup Forever, but I'm already halfway through it, so I needed another one. This is the Ardell um, Pro Brow Defining Kit. So it has like the little um, brow grooming pencil, so it's like a wax, so your brows can stay down. Then it has the powders, and I'm assuming there's a brush in there, and then, oh, the little brush is right here. Duh. And then it has a little spoolie on the end of it. And this is the Nani Cream color prevails and this is a mascara it's ombre mascara so you put the purple one on first and then you put the black on the tips and it's supposed to look like ombre lashes but I have a feeling that's not going to be very volume or volumizing and stuff it's probably gonna be like a basic mascara so probably gonna have to put other mascara on first this is the Pacifica natural minerals cream lipstick and I'm assuming it is the color of the box so I want to open this cuz I haven't even looked at this yet and I've never even heard of this brand so let's see. Oh, yep. Yes, you guys. They already knew what colors I was into. Like, I feel like they made this just for me. Got a Buxom, and I broke it. Okay. Got a Buxom eyeshadow palette and has a little brush in there. I've been using this, and I guess maybe they're meant to slide out. Like maybe, I don't know if they're not. not okay, they are actually because there's a tab right there. You can like switch them and stuff. Oh, you can even take the colors out. Oh, that's pretty cool. Or I've tried their BB cream before. The anti-blemish matte primer. So they said to put this on your skin if you have like acne and then you put your foundation and all that stuff on before or after. But I don't know because whenever you put something with like salicylic acid or benzoyl peroxide on your skin and you put something on top of it, your skin gets really dry in that area. So I don't think I'm ever going to do that. But I have tried it for like spot treatment. Because I had like a really bad pimple like somewhere around here while I was in California and I tried it and now the pimple's gone. So that was pretty cool. This is a lip liner or a eyeliner. This is a lip or an eyebrow pencil and it's just in the color brown. You guys probably couldn't even see that. I don't know why I did that. And then this is the other Smashbox eyeliner. I've been using this. It's in the color Smoke. It's their gel liner. And it is very, very pigmented. I really like that. And the last product, nope, not the last product, second to last is this Pixie by Petra. And this has a bronzer, another bronzer, a blush, and then it has like some highlighters. It says crease, eye, eyelid, whatever. A bunch of different stuff in there. So that's pretty cool. Yes. And the last product in here is the Chilla 
Hello Beautiful Eyes in Ivory. So this is an ivory highlighter. So I'm probably gonna see, find myself using that one more. So my camera rudely cut me off and my camera charger is already packed away. So unfortunately I can't find it because then I'd have to go through like a thousand boxes and find it. But I wanted to end the video and that's basically everything that I got from Generation Beauty. Sorry for the ghetto outro, but I have no way of ending the video. It would have either been this or me simply just cutting the video and putting like a text box saying oh and thanks for watching and all that stuff or using like the webcam. But thank you guys so much for watching. If it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't have been able to even go to Generation in, or Generation Beauty in the first place because I've been saving my money to move out and all that stuff and I don't think I would have just like spent almost $100 on a beauty ticket. So if it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't have gotten invited and I wouldn't have had the chance to go in general. I wouldn't have been able to do half the things I do today if it wasn't for you guys. Trust me. So yeah, that's everything that I got. I hope you guys enjoyed this beauty haul from Generation Beauty. I definitely encourage you guys to try to go um, whenever you can. I recommend starting a YouTube channel and trying to build it up for next year's because then you can just get invited for free. And it's even more convenient if you're already in California. You just have to drive. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you all in my next video. Subscribe to become a member of the Franco family and peace out. Yeah. Yeah, yeah.